Women's beach volleyball is one of the most popular spectator sports at the Olympics. And while they may not enjoy the same sponsorship as soccer, rugby or cricket, that only makes Sheena train harder. Her aim to play on the world tour. How did you get into beach volleyball? When I was 12 years old, my cousin taught me how to play beach volleyball. She was training for the Olympic Games and since then I always knew that is what I wanted to do. I understand you've gone through a lot of obstacles medically, but you really have pushed through. Yeah, oh, where did I start? <laughs> when I was six years old, I had my kidney removed um, and then from there, when I was about 16, I've had my appendix operation and then I got my first DVT, which is deep vein thrombosis. So it's a blood clot and it can be really fatal. Um, from there I kept on training, then I had two knee operations. After my second knee op, the doctor told me I'd never be able to play volleyball again. I'd be lucky if I can just walk pain free. And for me I decided, you know, that is not the be all and end all. And, and after that I just kept on training hard. Um, it was a long process but, you know, mentally I was really tough and I was not going to let that be the end of my beach volleyball career. And now I'm trying to qualify for the Olympic Games. Your perseverance is so inspirational. You really do work hard. Shall we see if I can keep up? Let's go. Sheena's not that tall for volleyball, so her training is designed to give her explosiveness out of the sand. Sheena looks pretty tough. What's it like training her? Now, Sheena is every coach's ideal athlete. She's always working hard in class and is also very eager to learn new movements, so it makes for a great crossfit athlete. What exercises are we going to do to get beach volleyball ready? Right, so we started with the back squats. It's a great strength foundational movement. Uh, it's mainly for the hip complex. So you work the hips, the quads, and uh, all the girls want a tight tush. That's how you get it right here. And also, it's a great core exercise as well, loading a heavy weight on your back through those movements. It's great for core, legs, quads, the work. So it's a nice core round exercise to do. And then next up, for some explosive power, we'll do the burpee box jumps. There's also a little bit of a cardio workout, gets the heart rate up. It's a lot of fun to do. And then last but not least, we'll finish off with the war ball, which kind of incorporates the squats and the arms. Also great hand and eye coordination, which carries over into volleyball. Oh, my arms are feeling it. You're also a full-time biokinesthetist. How do you manage to balance everything and still have energy to train twice a day? Well, just having, you know, good perseverance. I come here at six in the morning till seven. After that I go to work and I work from 8 till 5 and then I have volleyball again from 6 till 8 in the evening. So just a good nutrition, lots of sleep when I can and yeah, just trying to keep it as balanced as possible. It was after her second knee operation that a then 24-year-old Sheena switched from indoor to beach volleyball. She asked Carla Swanepoel and Moicha Cargo to ease Jade into the game. Okay, Jade, so the first movement I'm going to teach you is the dig, which is one of the most important movements in beach volleyball. Okay, so keep the ball for me. Right, so I'm going to explain. So you want to have your one dig slightly in front of your other leg. Okay, and then very important, you want to take your left hand out, put your right hand over. You want to make sure you have a nice flat surface. So you want the ball to connect on your forearm. You're going to bend your knee slightly and then throw the ball to me. And then I'm going to dig to you. Okay, now your turn. Okay, ready? Yeah, yeah. yeah. try to get a bit higher. One more. That's it. Perfect, <laughs> that's a good one. Good. Okay, so the second one I'm going to teach you is the set. Okay, so when you're setting, I'm just going to put the ball down. You want your, again, you want a good base in the legs. You want the arms nice and high. You're going to get the ball and you're going to set out. So you're going to use your arms and your legs, and you're going to push the ball up. That's it. Okay, do you want to try? Let's throw it to you. Okay, ready? And go. Yeah, good, good. Okay, one more. Here we go. Nice, good. perfect. Let's go, I think you're ready for a match. Game on. Yeah. Teaching the sport and playing tournaments on beaches around South Africa are ways of raising funds and awareness of the game. The other would be to play at the Olympics in Rio next year. And while Sheena is still to qualify, her brother Kyle and life partner Carla Swanepoel have a very good feeling she will. Carla, I've seen Sheena at the gym, I've seen her play volleyball. What is she like at home? Um, she's pretty much energetic at home as well. Um, her idea of resting is uh, eating or sitting on a yoga mat and using a foam roller or her elevation mask which helps for, for breathing. Um, yeah, and her downtime is actually training me, you know. <laughs> 
Carl, your sister's gunning for the Olympics. You're apparently competing in a Brazilian jiu-jitsu competition. Has your family always been this sporty? We've been athletes basically since young. I can remember my dad waking us up every morning at 6 o'clock, going for those 5K runs. I hated that. <laughs> <laughs> and we've been training, especially Sheena, since day one. She knew that this was what she wanted to do. And to see her succeed now is quite awesome. She's told me for years and years she's going to be a sponsored volleyball player, she's going to play professionally and she is what she said she would be and I'm quite proud of her. She in a nutshell is always focused on the goal 100% and that's why she is where she is today. Do you have any advice for young ladies who want to pursue a career in sports? I think the most important thing is to stay dedicated, stay focused, stay determined and do it for yourself, do it for no one else. Well I'll cheers to that. <laughs> cheers, 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 cheers everyone. Sheena has a master's degree in her sight and she's resolved to grow the sport and the life skills it teaches to children in need across the country.